subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Title, Installing a Finance in Python, a step-by-step -step tutorial. Introduction a Finance is a powerful Python library that provides an easy-to-use interface for fetching financial data from Yahoo Finance. In this tutorial, we'll guide you through the process of installing a Finance and demonstrate how to use it to retrieve stock data in Python. Step 1. Install a Finance. Before using a Finance, you need to install it. Open your terminal or command prompt and type the following command. This command will download and install a finance and its dependencies. Step 2. Import a finance in your Python script or Jupyter notebook. Now that a finance is installed, you can use it in your Python script or Jupyter notebook. Open your preferred code editor and import a finance. Step 3. Fetch stock data. You can use a finance to fetch historical stock data, current stock information, and more. Let's start by fetching historical stock data for a specific symbol. In this example, we replace AAPL with the stock symbol of your choice and set the start and end dates for the historical data. The yf.download function is used to retrieve the stock data between the specified dates. Step 4. Fetch current stock information. You can also use a finance to fetch the current information of a stock, such as its price, market cap, and more. Replace AAPL with the desired stock symbol, and the yf.ticker object is used to fetch current information about the stock. Conclusion In this tutorial, we covered the steps to install a finance in Python and demonstrated how to use it to fetch historical and current stock data. A finance is a versatile library that can be further explored for additional financial analysis and visualization. Feel free to explore the finance documentation for more advanced features and capabilities.